All right, hello everyone, and welcome back to Dead Space 2. This is part two, where last time we completed the first two chapters of the game, so we're now in chapter three, where we just had a hell of a train ride uh, before crash landing uh, into this warehouse. Everything has gone to shit, and Isaac is Isaac has uh, been experiencing delusions uh which is to be expected when you experience something up close with the marker but apparently another one got made and is around here somewhere because of course it is because why wouldn't you just make another marker uh when you're crazy about necromorphs you know it's uh it's just a, it's just a fun time just a fun time for everybody um so let me just chuck a quick little save in here we'll do that while we're here Move into chapter three. Got our fancy new suit back. And uh, we're just going to go back to killing some some lovely friends. Oh, great. Oh, great. It runs away. That's never a good thing. It's going to run away and yell at me. I love the mentality in, De in Dead Space 2 that it, it's it's a total, like, if it ain't broke, don't fix it mentality. Like, the UI is exactly the same. Um, like, probably some minor changes, but it's essentially exactly the same. It's like, your rig in canon logically needs to kind of look the same unless you get, like, a, a firmware update so it looks different. Uh, but they decided, you know... It it works fine. Everything looks good. Health bar on the on the back of the suit is perfect. I love it so much. But like everything, you know, even like when you pick up items and how you find power nodes and like they were just like, the, oh shit, Jesus. Uh, they were like, look, the the first game works. The first game just works flawlessly in terms of its systems, almost. Except we will fix the reload button. And that's that almost is it. But like, I'm I'm happy. I'm happy with it. There's no confusion between games of having to adjust to a different thing outside of a couple of minor control changes. But you're just like, all the UI, <laughs> all the UI is so familiar and easy to get back into. Trixie's fine candies. Yummy, yummy. Let me in! This is the kind of branding that I love in in Dead Space. It's so good. Space branding. Space Cat. Lemon Gun. Let me go play Lemon Gun, whatever it is. Instead, I'm stuck in depressive, horrifying city. Oh. Oh, it's it's the thing that ran away from me before. What the fuck? Excuse me. No. Oh. Back away. Back away. Back away. Back away. Fucking hell spawn. Yeah, that's fucking right. Like a basketball. Get off of me! Oh my... I died! I actually died. Jesus fucking Christ. They don't mess around, do they? Tall skinny babies. Tall skinny babies. Oh yeah, you can use stasis. That is, that is true. But then it's not as fun. Then it's not as fun. Alright, at least they go down in one hit. This is easier than punching them. You can get multiple. Leave me alone. Is there one coming from... no. Dude, the way that the legs just come off. Jesus. 
A, B, C's. Oh. I think you're still alive. We can't talk. I think they're tracking our signals. Are the memories coming back to you? They're coming back to me. The good ones. And the bad ones. The more I remember, the more my head hurts. I keep seeing the symbols. Do you know the symbols too, Isaac? In him. I keep seeing his face. Shit, family. This guy's creepy as hell. He ruined my window shopping though, so that guy, he sucks. Ray Price, the ABCs. Solar Worm. Mind Flyer. Let me go in. Looks, it looks good in there, it looks safe, it looks comfortable. Light Speed. Yeah, we're in an arcade. I love it so much. All right, we can now get a pulse rifle. We are going to buy the said pulse rifle. I'm not really, I don't really care. Oh. You know what? You know what? I might go with the javelin gun instead of the pulse rifle, at least, at least for now. Okay. Because we do have a couple of javelin spears. The line racks, we sell those. We sell those. Alright. So you just pull the right trigger to fire a nice little imp impaling spear javelin. We got ten of them. We can electrify the last javelin that was used. Amazing. Home at the concourse. Oh. Ah! Kill him before he runs away. Oh my god, this is fucking spectacular. Hey Dana, there's this crazy guy that keeps contacting me. I saw him back in the hospital. Nolan Strauss. He was a patient in the project, just like you. Yeah? Well, why was he there? What does he want? He's a psychopath, Isaac. Stay clear of him. He murdered his own wife and child. Ooh. Okay, I'll be careful. He's a psychopath. Oh, this is great. I love it when there is, like, horror in, like, a setting like this. Where it's just, like... <laughs> everything is kind of, like... Obviously, like, none of this stuff's gonna change. This is weird, right? That's the Unitology building. They just have that in the plaza. Blood on the phone. Fit meter. Attention. This is Director Titan. A station-wide emergency is in effect. In accordance with Titan Station's oh. code, I am declaring martial law. There he is. Citizens are ordered to evacuate. Looters will be shot on sight. This is not a drill. I don't think there's anyone here to shoot the looters. Yeah, of course we have to go into the Unitology building. Attention. This is Director Titan. A station-wide emergency is in coming effect. soon. In accordance with Titan Station. Unitology gift bags. That's so weird. Weird cult. <laughs> Can I <laughs> putting the body in there? Here, levitations, levitations. Look, you made it! Just like the advertisement. Just like the ad said. Amazing. <gasps> Everything's good with Peng! Dude, that's all you need. Just as long as you've got Peng. There's always Peng, dude. Love the consistency in ads from, uh, from the first one. 
cl the clogger. Bruh. There's a secret party going on in there. Alright, there's a text log. Titan, part two. Titan Station, Conquering the Moon, part two of two. A large colony was established on Titan to study the moon's every seismic detail and prepare it for disassembly. As the operation got underway, the orbital platforms that assisted with the work became the prototypes for the planet crackers that would soon follow. Titan was successfully cracked and harvested only slightly behind schedule. It was a major boost for the then beluged beleaguered, beluged population of Earth, on Earth who believed their extinction from lack of resources was imminent. Titan's harvest was halted before the entire moon was disassembled, leaving the small shard where the original colony had started. From here, the station grew in leaps and bounds as the new era of planet cracking got underway, serving as both a critical research outpost and with the advent of shockpoint drives, a way station for all planet cracking missions going forward. It is now whimsically known as the Sprawl for having done just that over the many years of its operation. Nice. Okay. Time to check out the Unitology building. Attention. This is Director Tightman. A station-wide emergency. Find your piece. I like that as a new system, however, from something new. I mentioned that before already. Textilog. Altman's Footsteps, a publication for the followers of Michael Altman. We, the children of the marker, grow tired of the oppressive, thinly veiled attacks from EarthGov on our rights to worship as we please. Reduced hours of operation for the church, fire marshal restrictions on the size of revival events, permits needed to distribute literature. These are all poorly concealed attempts to quash the truth. Our truth! And they will not succeed. The blasphemous, short-sighted, reckless, destructive, and hopeless path that EarthGov has on us is a dead end. Oh, one that only Unitology has the answer to. Altman has foreseen it, and we are blessed to execute it. Prepare yourselves, brothers and sisters. Convergence is nigh. Sounds like crazy talk to me. God, this lift. Dana, Free information. I you me to residential. This looks like a unitology recruitment center. Am I still on track? Yes. There's an old maintenance access point in there that'll take you through the waste disposal system and into the Cassini Towers. Stay sharp. Recruiting, Titan Station Church of Unitology, Recruiting Report, Perry uh, Gibault, Vested Member, Teeth Status, Fully Paid. Recruiting has slowly mark slowed markedly in the last few weeks. This is surely due to EarthGov's recent slander campaign, painting us as carpetbaggers and insurrectionists in the press. Regents from the churches at Venus Wayport and the Heliopause Observer are shocking in later this week uh, to, strat to strategize a response. A shocking in. I've never heard of using shocking as like a, you know, they're, cut, they're, you know, they're coming in, they're dropping by, they're coming to say hello. They're shocking in <clears throat> to strategize a response. Expect additional budget to be allocated to public relations and media to combat this trend. Also, the CEC layoffs continue to negatively affect recruiting targets. We're down almost 30% year on year. Jabot out. Give me your money. Doesn't look as good down here. Oh, shit. Oh god. Ah! Oh no! You did that on purpose, you stupid game! No! Ooh! For a second, I thought that was meant to happen! 
You're supposed to stasis something, aren't you? You have to. What the fuck? I just got absolutely fucking decimated. I was like, oh, there's gonna be a struggle and then something will happen to like... Fuck me. Okay, how do I deal with this? Okay, there's some... what is this? Alright, should I just wait until they get a bit closer? We missed our opportunity to blow, blow them all up together, which is such a shame. Okay. Dude, I didn't- I had no idea- Ah! Ah! Kids! Get away! Oh my fucking god! Whose bright idea was this? Get off of me! Jesus Christ. Shell. I got no health. I got no health packs. I am essentially screwed. Alright, what does this do? Oh, this is one of those tunnels, right. Alright, hold on. No! Go back. I want to check out around here first. Oh, yeah, nice. Future expansion. Amazing. All right, let's head on through. Need to get some health soon, or I'm going to get eaten by fucking demon babies. This is what happened to all those crying babies, they turned into those things. Ah, uh, okay. What happened to you, buddy? <clears throat> thank you. Not nearly enough, but sure. Oh, thank you. Nice. Okay, the game gave me a bit of what I needed. Okay. Whoever sees this, listen up. You can use Kinesis to pull blades off dead ones and shoot it back at them. Watch. Watch. Stay alive three hours using this trick. You see? Just shoot it back at them. <laughs> I'm gonna bleed out soon. I got clipped pretty bad over there. So I hope this helps you out. Whoever you are. Nice. Should we hold on to it? Is there gonna be one that will appear? Zero G garbage compactor. I'm supposed to go this way. This is locked anyway. It's so good pulling the pulling the arms off. Control room. Stomps on. Sh oh, I see. Okay, we're gonna have to. We're gonna have to make it through there. I see. I see what's happening. We have to make it through in time. <laughs> Tunnel two is closed. 
Tunnel 1 is closed. Just uh, have a look at this bench. Uh, we got four nodes. Alright, javelin gun, the alternate fire, or the damage. Right, we're going to be here for a while trying to figure out what's going to be the best ones to go for. Let's go for... I don't want to... and reload. Work my way over to HP of the rig. Okay. Shut this boy down. All tunnels are closed. Oh, quick, do the thing! <laughs> Fuck. Give me a fucking. Oh! Let me stay! Fuck off! Dude! How did he survive? I guess he didn't go up against this many of them. Jesus. God. Chill, everybody. Oh my God. Ah, right. into the garbage room. Into the garbage room, fly boy. Ah, oh, nice. Okay, we are now back in zero gravity time. Did it not? It used to be. Hang on. What's. Is there a different button now? Shit. Oh. Oh. Oh, that's cool. Oh, that's awesome. Okay, so here I am aiming and going, oh yeah, you press the Y button to go. Okay, so this is another control change, but I'm not, I'm not against this at all. This is actually cool. Oh, your suit can move. That's so much better. That's awesome. Oh, that's so fucking cool. That's how it should be. That's how it fucking should be. Ah, oh, we have to go through the door. I guess we can go through that thing on the right. Maybe we need to turn it off when the uh, doors open. Dude, I love that There's so much more. Hello, sir. I'm here for your power node. Help you get some more health soon. Probably when I go to the next bench. Can't bother going back here. Oh, this is so cool. Can I pick this up? I thank you. I love good quality of life changes like that. That's like awesome. Ah, we open it here. Go. We have to like go against the. Oh, oh, sorry, sorry, trash cube. I'll get out of your way. 
Oh, this is fucking cool. Orient to ground. Ah, oh, and you can even orient to the ground. They put some thought into this one. Fucking incredible. God, that's so much better than what it was. One small step for Isaac. <gasps> Spooky! Guys, we turned the light off. It's scary now. It's spooky. Ready for the jump scares? Are you ready for the jump scares? There it is. There's one. The first jump scare. Yeah, power no door, bitch. Oh, okay, so they still operate on the same power. Power bricks. Place you in a minute. Give me a sec. I'm going to do this first. Bonus door. Oh, give me the fucking money. I'm rich, bitch. Nice. I start using one of these. I need to actually hold this so I remember that I have a secondary gun. Are we gonna. You bet we're gonna use it. Alright. This thing. Uh, helps if I actually know where I'm putting this thing. Ah, oh, it's right next to it, because it's a tutorial! Does the store turn on? No! Or is there a power thing for... Is there a separate power thing? No. Doesn't look like it. You cannot turn the store on. The old elevator cleaning schedule. Need some more elevator music. Ah, and just in case you didn't have a power node for that door before, you do now. Oh no, cult room. Guys, what did I tell you about? Ah! Oh no! Oh no, I'm using a javelin. Hold on. Shit. Did I? Is that thing on there mine? Ah, oh, I guess you could... Can I...? No. But it, I can, like, electrify it. Such an idiot. So you can electrocute the last one used, and also that can affect you. Bruh. You can electrocute yourself. Not a fan. Okay, if I'm going up against those fucking tiny ones, I'm not going to use the javelin thing. Didn't even... God damn it. Text log found. From Sally Hennon to Marion Hennon. Marion, I'm just going to leave this log here for you to find when you come get the rest of my stuff. I hope I don't forget anything. This is a really big deal. The rebirth is going to happen very, very soon. Just like they said, this is a very special time. Like, once in a lifetime. Actually, once in a million lifetimes. They say we've been preparing for this since before we were human. Do you know how special that makes us? We're the ones who get to see it. I'm so excited my skin is tingling. I've got chills. Okay, I've got to go. The ceremonies begin in, half, in a half hour. I don't want to be late. Bye, sis. I love you so much. Come join us. Ha ha. K. Bye. Sally. Come join the 
Unitology Club. It's like Scientology, but in dead space. Unitology. <laughs> fucking javelin bitch! Get electrocuted! Oh, that's so fucking cool. That's so fucking cool. I'm so glad we bought the, the javelin one instead of, like, the plasma boy. Because we already used the plasma guy. Damn, that's a cool gun. Oh, you were having a little snack, were you? You were feasting. How dare you? These guys believed in you. <gasps> you had a fucking monument, bitch. To join is to survive. Save the marker. To join is to survive. Look at me. Alive on this bed. Oh, this is creepy. The marker will save us. Oh! God. I'm not Nicole. Nicole's dead. You're not really here. <laughs> You're not Nicole. Nicole didn't have flashlights coming out of her eyeballs. It's a dead giveaway. You gotta try harder next time. Keep us safe from the monsters. I'm trying to make it like the kids wrote it on the wall. They're at kids level. A kid saw God. Mommy is sick. Help! No school forever. <laughs> Enjoy. Enjoy what? Get the skateboard out of the way. Enjoy the pain! Jesus. Alright kids. Take me home. Country roads, take me home, dead space to Necromorph Boogaloo. No! Everyone's like so fucking fucked up around here, what the fuck? Dude, there's a full on bitch. It's it's crazy out here. Guys, I am uncomfortable. What have you done with the place? Dana, Time and soldiers have found me. They're tracking me in some sort of gunship. You're almost here. Hurry. Yo, turn down the high beams. I can see you. How did it not get electrocuted before? The last one I did. That's weird. Oh well. Something that's different in this game compared to Dead Space 1 that I don't like is so tiny. It's such a weird nitpicky thing, but I notice it. Is in the first game, when you pick up an item, it had like a confirmation noise that you picked up the item. It, it's not in this game. So I keep thinking I haven't picked up the item because it's just silent. When you, when you pick it up, you find an item, it makes the noise that there's an item there, like it goes, here's that item, but then it doesn't confirm that I picked it up, like it used to. I will show you another example on the next item. Let me use the elevator in peace, please. That's interesting.
do a save. Just chill out. Relax. Take a deep breath. It's fine. It's just it's just creepy apartments in the Unitology Center. It's fine. Take a break. It's fine. Is this... No. Okay. It's not going to be a real one. Where's the... Oh, shit. No! Put that man down! Put that man down! No! Put him down. Shit. I was that close to stopping. Stopping it. Stop. Stop. Stop crawling towards me like that. Are you still alive without a head and you're still vomiting at me without a mouth? God damn it. They just don't quit, do they? <gasps> Fuck! Stop! Chill out. I wonder where the... Hey! Hey! Ah, not me! You can't even get into my face, I'm wearing a helmet! Here, you won't be needing that anymore. Get out of here. Jesus. Uh, I wonder where the real marker is, because they said that there was a new one that was created, and I was like, eh, this guy is pretty big. But I guess this is just... I don't know, it seems like the perfect place to sit one. Schematic for Javelin Spears. It seems like the spot that you would put a marker in the Unitology building, right in the center of town. But who knows. I think it would be glowing more red with all those symbols. Right now, if it was the real deal. Jesus, what the fuck? Dude, this is fucked. Prophet and the Mod Aeon 01. Divine Discovery. In 2214, a geophysicist named Michael Altman made a discovery that would change history. Buried at the impact site of a crater near the Yucatan Peninsula, he uncovered a divine alien presence. The Marker. The Marker spoke to Altman and revealed a plan that would unify mankind and lead them to a bright new future. By the millions, people flocked to hear more about the Marker and the unity it promised after Michael Altman told the world of his profound discovery. But there were those who felt threatened by Altman's message. On March 15, 2215, Altman was assassinated and thus became the first martyr for the church. First martyr for the church. Three. Founding the church. Altman's followers mourned his death but found divine solace in his message of unity. They would not allow the truth to be silenced and form the Church of Unitology to bring his teachings to the world. Aliens. Alien strong. Today, the Church of Unitology can be found everywhere in the known universe. Its message is just as strong and relevant today as it was when Altman first revealed it. Billions of believers can be found across all social, economic, and cultural groups, and more are joining every day. Damn, bitch, you worship like this? Bringing light to Titan. Growing from a small group of devout miners on Titan, the Titan Station Church of Unitology has flourished into a hub of Unitology worship, practice, and learning. It boasts one of the largest and most beautiful churches in the soul system, and is often the site of the annual Unitology Enigma Symposium. Does that mean the Marco is in the middle of the city? Or like it's just out in the open, like surrounded by the city? Looking into the future. As 
we await glorious convergence, it is important to continue to nurture our relationship with the Marker and understand the future it is preparing for us. The Marker calls to all of us. It is our duty to approach it with an open heart and open mind. Fucking crazy, dude. What the fuck? Oh, it's the gun He's coming! He's found you! Into the church! Hurry! Uh, let's not get shot to pieces, shall we? Jesus. Being pushed further into the church. Chapter 4. Dana, the Church of Unitology? Why here? It's one of the few places on Titan Station that Tideman can't monitor. Separation of church and state. No, no. Dana, we shouldn't be in here. This is the last place we want to be right Isaac, now. Isaac! My brother died trying to rescue you. This is important. This will work. I'm in a safe room at the top of the church. Meet me there, okay? Why the fuck are you in the church? Advanced locator. Ah. Yo. Oh, that's cool. That's awesome. Dude, amazing quality of life changes. I'm here for it. That wasn't in the first one, I'm pretty sure. Okay, so we got to go <laughs> indoctrination. The sovereigns in there, guys. Start tour. Welcome to the Titan Station Church of Unitology. We're glad you've come to visit our sanctuary and place of light and hope. Our tour guides are looking forward to showing you the best of our beliefs and what a meaningful and enlightening impact we can have in your daily life. There is, of course, no obligation of any kind with this tour. Kindly remember to stay with your tour guide at all times. Someone will be with you shortly. Dude, um, this is fucked. Like, expanding on the un the whole unitology thing and, like, the fascination with the marker and, like, going into, like, even, like, a full church about it is fucking crazy. God damn. Log. Attention, tour guide staff. Please remember to keep all visitors in your sight at all times. The indoctrination centers are strictly off limits to the casual public. Remember, be the light in the room for those who walk in darkness. Uh, so at that shop that we were looking at before that had all the cool, cute stuff, there was a picture of this dude with this helmet. That's the that's the big boy, yeah. The Enigma mask. The Enigma statue replica. Fucking bizarre. Scientology. Uh, let me upgrade my health with a node, and then I'll keep keep one on hand, as always. Let's download that javelin schematic. I'd actually buy a couple. I wonder if I'm going to get a... I wonder if I'll get... anything soon in terms of like a, a new new piece of armor I'm just gonna chuck the stasis away for now because I don't think I'll necessarily need it 
Have a nice day. But that's why we save here, just in case. I thought I felt it was like yeah, funerary wing, funerary wing, reading room. Beyond these doors lies the reading room, a place where believers are encouraged to relax and meditate on the teachings of the church. The shelves are lined with select inspirational materials as well as a variety of meditation aids. Please respect the sanctity of this space and those using it by remaining quiet and reverent while in. Ugh. Quiet. Jesus Christ. Let's take a read of that text log. Two tines entwined from the words of our savior, Michael Altman, we know that all life intertwines the end to become one, one mind, one body, one voice. The marker echoes this with its intertwined spires. We echo this with our entwined arms. Fingers touching in oneness at the top. It is our sacred ceremonial gesture used in greeting and in opening, in the opening to all ceremonies, large and small. I take no... Isaac, can you see the symbols too? What do you mean for the straws? Yes, I see the symbols. We are a threat to them. I know it. We have to work together. Work together? Who's them? When you mean Titan? Strauss. Work with me, Strauss. Where? <gasps> the bodies are gone. The bodies are gone. See, it's like it makes the noise when the item pops up. Only sometimes it makes the noise. I've been proven wrong. But when I picked up the line racks before, it, it made, I think it made a noise and then it didn't on the other one. See, it didn't make a noise then. I think it doesn't make a noise if I'm moving. The cathedral reported two pressure equalization cycles during services last Sunday. The first was minor and only blew some candle flames around, giving Pastor O'Brien a much needed, if unexpected, boost in his sermon. Uh, the second cycle was more harsh, resulting in a pressure snap that popped people's ears and sent several to medical. That was not needed. Yeah, okay, so sometimes the item makes a noise when you pick it up, but it is inconsistent. I guess you just need to stand still. Welcome to the Unity Hall. This magnificent library holds copies of the church's most sacred text and is a regular meeting place for the Unitology scholars as they debate the glorious mysteries of the Black Marker. So to the This is such a cool weapon. I love it. Makes me happy. Alright, ready? I'm gonna like... See, it didn't make it for those two, so it's it's inconsistent, and I don't know why. Chalk it up to it being a tiny bug. What the fuck? Down here? I heard you in my ears. Oh, you've. Oh, you! Get away! Get zapped! Get zapped! 
are they wearing? Oh, I was hoping it would get a group. It almost did. Holy fuck, dude. How many of them are there? God! It's like acid on my body. Jesus. How many stasis packs do you want to give me, guys? Before we go deeper, I need to sell some things, because I've just got a whole bunch of stasis packs that I don't need as many as I've got. Let me go back to the store. This place is so fucked up. Like, there's the ones that are just running at me in, like, the different outfits. No, thank you. Okay. Let's have an upgrade while I'm here as well. Okay, javelin. Let's do the alt fire and speed. TK impalement. Hold on to it for now. Man, imagine thinking going through this fucking Unitology church would be a good idea. Well done, Dana. Happy to have you guiding me. So she's just chilling in the church safe house. Cargo lift. Welcome to Indoctrination. A church seminar is currently in progress. Please wait for the next available church associate. Indoctrination, Indoctrination huh? is a event where you will take the first steps into glorious oneness. That is. Oh, hang on. Did I just... Oh, okay. It opened... It opened a shortcut. Nice. Imagine it. All mankind brought together with one purpose. 
with one mind, with one soul. No war, no fear, no hate. If that sounds like an ideal world to you, then look no further. Convergence is coming, and Unitology is helping it happen. Bruh, you all turn into fucking... You all turn into fucking necromorphs. That's as war. That's as fucking war as it gets, my guy. Indoctrination rooms. Cool. Hey, sit in this chair and look at this screen. Nothing bad's gonna happen. I promise. Look what happened to this one. She's fine. Indoctrination test phase one. Results for Casey Milham. Desire to socially belong high, unassertiveness low, gullibility low, tolerance for ambiguity high, cultural dis uh, disillusionment low, idealism high, susceptibility to trance-like states low, self-confidence high, a desire for spiritual meaning low, awareness of group influence on individuals high. The subject is highly unlikely to stay affiliated with the church after a short period of time. We would expect him to exit the system after the, the teething requirements section of initiation. We should invite him to go as far as he'd like, but do not book future earnings Please against him. For the observation center door in the junction panel. Vandalism in the church is not permitted. The indoctrination, it just flashes the image of... Oh, see you later. Michael Altman at you. Ah, that's what we need. Okay. Nice. Where do I have to... Ah, oh, cool. Figured it out before I even looked at the thing. There we go. Get in there. Oh, cool. And then you use stasis on the door. Okay. Makes sense. Shh. Fucking... Give me that. Ah! Eat my chair! Far out. Chaos. Oh, could almost blow that open again and then die. Gotta be careful about those. Why did I do that? <laughs> but Stasis on it when the door was closed. How long does it last for? <laughs> there we go. She doesn't sound like a very nice girlfriend, does she? Dude, this fam- this family's fucking everywhere. That dude's worked a lot of jobs and he puts a family photo of his- him- him and his wife everywhere he goes. Yeah, security. Oh, security suit. Not just is, is it a is it a different? It's not just upgrading the suit that we have, but it's a different suit altogether. Can't wait to find out. But we finally got a suit upgrade. Oh! Oh! Fucking hell!
Dude, he's fucking doing it to himself. What the fuck? He was just having a mental battle with himself then. Imagine if he fucking lost. Just stabs himself in the face. Jesus. Playing as an in insane protagonist certainly has uh, its interesting moments. Where's this? Ah, the indoctrination, that's the... Okay, so we... another... Another shortcut back home. Lovely. Dude, this is so fucking good, but so fucked. Lift will take me down. Infidels. What a nice message. Save yourself. Looks nice down here, guys. Love what you've done with the place. Can't see any monsters, but you can fucking be sure to hear them. <sighs> it's a glowing red marker. Where? What the fuck? That's back where we came from through there. If only we could open this door. This gives me like almost like Bioshock vibes. Like you could imagine, I could imagine seeing this room in Bioshock, and that's like underwater, and that's like the light coming through. It's like a Bioshock kind of area. Gives you that same scary horror stuff too. Where the fuck are those noises coming from? All the fucking markers on the wall are lit up. How do we... Oh, fucking hell. Data, I'm locked out. There's something in the church. It, it broke the door. Hang on. I'll try to override all the gates in the area. Hurry. There's something out here, too. Fucking hell. What the fuck is in here? Oh. There you are. Oh. Eat my fucking ass. No! What the fuck are they? What the fuck? Isaac! I don't think I can open them out! <laughs> Dude! Stop! What are they do? Dude! They're fucking hiding from the light! I broke them. Dude, what the fuck? As soon as you turn the... Oh my god. As soon as you turn your flashlight off, they like run towards you. Oh! Hey, whoa! How did it fucking dodge me?
Oh my god. Fuck off! I keep missing it! Dude! Oh my god, stop fucking hiding. Ah! Of course you got me too. Jesus. Dana, you there? Isaac, I can't unlock the elevator. Can you do anything from your rent? Let me see what I can do. Okay, once you're through, you'll go through the funerary ring of the church and down into the crypt. It's very important you not be dead. Lol. No. It's very... No, Earth Cup can't jam it from here. Not through here. Dana! Dana! Important that I want! Classic. Hey, it's important that Well, good luck with that. Fucking hell. Those things are fucked up. Couldn't open like this one for me. Okay. Oh, this room puts you on edge just a tiny bit. Hauntingly. Of our formal ceremonies. Its architecture is rich in symbolism, and the stained glass ceilings are forged from no less than the sands of Jupiter. From the sands of Jupiter themselves. Yeah, all right. And where did that get you? Nowhere. Preparation. Reunion chapel. Attention. Please be quiet when observing the funerary rituals of the church. Flashing and holographic imaging are not permitted Ooh. to the church. Thank you for your compliance. That's in marker text. Oh nice, the gift shop. This is a this is a wait. Ah, oh, there. Great shortcut. There we go. This is the one that we're waiting for. Security suit. Security suit grants unique functionality to the wearer. Weapon bonus. Pulse rifle receives a 5 plus 5% 5 bonus to damage. Purchase guarantees a minimum of 15 inventory slots and 10% armor. Your rig retains the highest upgrade of armor and inventory. Your rig retains the highest upgrade of armor and inventory. Cool, so if you change to another suit later that has lower slots and armor, you retain the highest. But you can still make use of the weapon bonus. So 5% plus, 15 slots and 10% armor. How, mu how many inventory slots do we currently have? Oh, uh, yeah, okay. that gives us another five. So let's buy the, su buy the security suit. So we get more space. Give it to me. Can you change to the older suit after that? Or change between suits you've already obtained then? I suppose you would have to be able to. So you can choose which bonuses you want. Dun, 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 dun. This is so much cooler. Oh, uh, you get like so much more of a variety. Cool. Instead of it just being like the same suit except with more pieces of armor, it's like you actually look different. That's cool. 
Yay, okay, so the engineering suit doesn't have a bonus, but it's in the safe. Cool. So now I just have... Now I just have a bonus to pulse rifle if I decide to use it. That's good stuff. Okay. a few upgrades in. Need to start focusing on that speed. Actually, I'll save. Need to start focusing on that speed for this guy and get that rate of fire up. Can't you see I'm busy? Oh my god, I'm getting stuck. No! Get the little ones off of me. Is what the pulse rifle is good for. I guess the javelin would be good as well if I did the javelin and then just did the electric shock. Oh, a funeral. Nice. Oh, look at the. There's like a reflection of a body in there. Disgusting. All life will one day return to it. Ah! The game never fails to to keep giving you those dead space jump scares. Dead space jump scares. Where would we be without them? Dead space jump scares, it's always the dead bodies jumping up at you. And yet, it gets me every time. It gets me every time. Do, 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 do. Make my own elevator music then. Bitch, we getting fucking weird. Look at these fucking doors, who? designs this shit. Chapter 5. Chapter 5. That is where we sit now. <sighs> With that one, guys, that is Chapter 3 and Chapter 4 completed. It looks like we have made it out of the Church of Unitology, but now we are in something else. A different kind. A different kind of horror environment which we will explore next episode. So guys, thank you so much for watching this episode of Dead Space 2, and I'll see you next time.